Welcome to Gradient Flow Snapshot number 13. In recent years, deep learning has achieved remarkable progress in voice and image recognition and other areas, but that achievement comes at a high cost. A new study from MIT and other universities finds that across many areas of deep learning, progress in training models has depended on large increases in the amount of computing power being used. How sustainable is this? Two related charts illustrate the unsustainable technical and economic cost of continuing deep learning growth along current lines. The study indicates that either deep learning must devise less computationally intensive methods, or the ML research community must start exploring other machine learning methods. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 14 for more. Water in America is an increasingly expensive utility. Millions of Americans today are at risk of losing running water or losing their homes if they cannot pay for it. A recent study by The Guardian examined water and sewage costs in 12 U.S. cities between 2010 and 2018. It found an 80% average cost increase, with over two-fifths of residents in some cities living in neighborhoods with unaffordable bills. Federal aid to public water utilities, which serve around 87% of Americans, has stagnated during much of this period, leaving local governments to pay for updating aging infrastructure and other issues. The Guardian and Consumer Reports are now launching a major new project on America's water emergency. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 14 for more. In the 16th century, Niccolo Machiavelli wrote, Men never do good unless necessity drives them to it. Contemporary Dutch historian Rutger Bregman disagrees. Bregman's new book is Humankind, A Hopeful History. He makes the case that humans are actually wired to be cooperative rather than competitive, and human evolution was really about the survival of the friendliest. We highly recommend this book. To learn more, visit gradientflow.com newsletter and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you.